Help, help me, please. I, I can feel it inside my skin. Something growing, like some kind of hideous disease. No, no, I can feel it. several skirmishes with looters from those lower city swoop gangs. I'm telling you, we should just stay in the upper city where we're in control. What was that while you're down here? Search and rescue. I didn't think they'd send anyone. They were in the southern section of the undercity when we lost contact. I would have gone to investigate, but my orders are to search for those crashed escape pods, even if it means leaving another patrol to die. Look out!
Back again? Is there some... Your offer is generous, Upworlder, but the villagers infected with the rat ghoul disease have been quarantined beyond this gate. At any moment, they could be transformed into terrible monsters. Nobody would be foolish enough to risk going into the pens to give them the cure. The infected ones could transform into rat ghouls and attack them at any moment. I can't stop you from going through the gates, Upworlder, but if the infected ones have already transformed into rat ghouls, you'll be walking into your grave. Please, help us! We're infected with the rat ghoul disease! At any moment we could... Uh... No! This cannot be... No! We beg you. We don't want to end up like the others. P please help us. We can't end up like them. You... you have a cure? Please give it to me, please, quickly, before it's too late. Quickly, I must inject it before it is too late. Yes, I feel it working. I feel the disease burning away. It... it's like a miracle. I am cured. Thank you, Upworlder. You have saved us from a fate worse than death. I only wish I had some reward to give you. Maybe you can find something worthwhile in the wreckage of that Republic escape pod. Not long ago, an escape pod crashed in the Undercity, far to the northeast of the village. We were going to try and salvage equipment from it, but we were attacked by the Rat Ghouls and infected. I'd tell you more if I could, but our salvage team never reached the pod. It's probably still there, unless some of the other Upworlders already found it and picked it clean. We should go now, Up You amaze me. I always thought the surface dwellers couldn't care less about us outcasts, but you risked everything to help those infected villagers. I wish I had some type of reward to give you, but we outcasts have nothing. All I can offer is the gratitude of the entire village. Greetings once more, Upworlder. Do you bring news of my apprentice? Have you discovered her fate and proved yourself to be a true savior of my people? It is as I feared, then. She joins the list of those who have given given their lives in the service of our cause. But though I am saddened by this news, there is yet hope. By finding my apprentice, you have proved yourself worthy, Upworlder. You are to be the beacon on our path to salvation. You will guide us to the promised land. You are marked, Upworlder. Even my dim old eyes can see the mantle of destiny that cloaks you. Perhaps old Rukil knows you better than you know yourself. I am old. I have lived a hundred years in the Undercity, cast down into the darkness. I know the legends and history of our people, and now you must learn it too. The great city of Taris covers the entire surface of this planet. There is no land to grow food. Kelp harvests and the creatures of the sea are our only food source. A century ago, rising levels of toxic pollution poisoned the oceans and famine swept the planet. The rich hoarded food for their own use and the poor were left to starve and die. From what I've seen of Terrace, it doesn't look like much has changed. Except for the upper city, people here are just as bad off as the poor in your little history. But the poor rose up against this tyranny, and civil war engulfed the planet. 
Millions died in the fighting, and huge sections of Taurus were destroyed or abandoned. The rebellion was crushed in the end. Thousands were taken prisoner. The jails could not hold them all, and so the practice of banishing all prisoners to the Undercity was born. Many brave men and women were banished here to the Undercity for their part in the rebellion. People like my father and grandfather were cast down along with their families. What did you expect? If they could get away with it, the Teresian nobles would stuff their own mothers down here to make more room in the Upper City. Now we live a dark existence beneath the streets of Terrace, a life devoid of all hope but one, the Promised Land. And you will be the one to show us the way to get there. Legends tell of a self-sufficient colony founded just before the famine and lost during the Civil War. A paradise beneath the Undercity where droid servants tend to every need. For many years I searched for the Promised Land, just as my grandfather and father did before me. When I became old and gray, my apprentice continued the search on my behalf. Sounds like a myth to me. Something to give the people here some false hope to cling to so they don't go mad with despair. I have collected many clues hinting at its location. The journal of my apprentice provides yet more information. But still, there are too many pieces missing from this puzzle. But I know my father and grandfather each had journals where they recorded their own discoveries. Perhaps, with their journals, I could at last uncover its hidden location. Yes, Upworlder. Well done. However, I see that this journal alone does not have enough clues for me to solve this mystery. Too many pieces are still missing. I'm afraid that only with all three journals, my grandfather's, my father's, and my apprentice's, I be able to discover the location of the Promised Land. I will leave this journal with you for safekeeping for now. Perhaps it will aid you in your search for the others. I wish you luck, Upworlder, for the sake of the entire village. I saw you talking with Rukul. He told you his legends about the Promised Land, didn't he? He told you all about his missing apprentice and the other lost explorers, right? You know, most people don't believe his stories. They figure he's nothing but an old cook. But I think there might be some truth in what he's saying. That's why I want to stop him. For an outcast, I've got things pretty good. The village relies on me to bring in food and supplies. I'm an important man. If it wasn't for Gendar, I'd be running this place. I get the feeling if it wasn't for Gendar, this place would be a lot worse off than it is. But if Rukul ever finds his promised land, I'm sunk. People won't need to rely on me anymore. I'll just be another nobody like all the rest of the villagers. I won't let that happen. Don't judge me. I learned a long time ago that if I want to survive down here, I've got to look out for number one. The two explorers who went searching for the Promised Land might have found something. They might have found clues or evidence, just like Rukul's apprentice. They would have recorded that information in their journals. I'll pay you if you bring all three journals to me. The two from the explorers and the one from Rukul's apprentice. Then I can destroy the evidence and make sure nobody ever finds the promised land. I've saved up enough credits for my business here to make it worth your while if you help me. Don't be a fool. I'm the only one here who can pay you for those journals. Rukil has nothing. He won't be able to come up with any kind of reward. Once you have all three journals, just bring them to me and I'll give you a decent reward. Now... Was there something else you needed? Yeah, okay. You'll come back and see me if you want a deal.
use one of those old-style manual locks. No computer codes or nothing. The sewers is the only place you'd see one of these on Terrace. You can't use conventional security spikes on these old locks. But don't worry. I've come across them before. I've rigged up a little device that should do the trick. I'm glad to see you too, Big Z. You didn't think I'd forget about you. Mission and Zalbar, together forever. These are my new friends, Big Z. Without them, I could never have gotten you out. by your side for the rest of your life. Wherever you go, whatever you do, Stalbar will be with you. I guess this means you're stuck with me, too. Wherever Big Z goes, I'm going. I almost lost him once. It's not gonna happen again. I still owe you one secret path into the Volkerbin place. That was the deal, wasn't it? Don't worry. I know a back door into that scum den. I better come with you. The Volkers put up a force shield to keep the sewer dwellers out. I'm one of the only non-Volkers on Terrace who can get you past it. I can't remember exactly how to get there, but I know it was somewhere here in the sewers. Over to the northeast, if I remember right. I just hope the Ranker monster isn't still there. There used to be a Ranker monster that made its nest in that part of the sewers. Pretty much eats anything it can get its claws on. That thing is huge! Luckily, Rankers aren't too bright. I was able to sneak past it before, so I'm sure we'll figure something out. That is, unless you want to change your mind. Okay then, off we go. Like I said, somewhere to the southeast. Just look for the force shield and we'll know we're there. Thank <laughs> you. 